Hey guys, it's Stark. And I'm Angela Meyer. And welcome back to your daily video announcements. Today for lunch, we have tater tot casserole, steamed peas and carrots, breadsticks, pineapples, cucumbers, graham crackers, and a cold milk. Let's take a look at today's holidays. Next, let's take a quick glance at your top five news stories of the day. Here are today's top five news stories. So several asteroids bigger than the Great Pyramid of Giza will, will approach Earth in coming weeks. Vegas Raiders coach John Gruden res resigns, apologizes for offensive remarks. Wichita City Council approves non-discrimination ordinance. Valley Center water tower de design may win awards. An elk had a car tire stuck around its neck for over two years. It's finally free. Now, let's take a quick look at one of our new teachers. I'm teaching ELA for 9th and 10th grade. I am most excited for getting to know my kiddos and recommending good books and kind of exciting them about the world of English. It's a little intimidating because I know a lot of uh, really awesome teachers here, so I hope um, they don't set the bar too high for me because uh, I probably will not reach it this year, but that's okay. Um, but, you know, uh, it's a family, it's a community, um, and I've kind of seen that as a student and now as a teacher kind of experiencing that as well. That's awesome. Oh boy. Well, I like to read, obvious answer I guess. Um, spend time outside. Uh, got some uh, cats and dogs at home that, you know, keep me happy. Um, watch movies, you know, just kind of doing my thing I guess. Next, let's play a game of who are these people? I'm Zeb Johnson. And I'm Brady Sainer. Patrick Mahomes. Bill Self. I have no clue. Adam, Adam Sandler. Sandler. <laughs> I have no clue. Is that Lane Frost? Yeah, Lane Frost. Bill Snyder. I don't know any of these people. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm Brady Sainer. Now for a quick round of Guess the Video Game Character. What's up, fellas? This here is... Maya Schaefer. And today, we are guessing some easy characters. Now, how about this one? That's Luigi. It is Luigi, in fact, from the Mario series. How about this one? Penguin. I don't know. Strangely, we've gotten that quite a lot, but this is King Dedede from the Kirby series. Remember that time he got really swole for some reason in Kirby Star Allies? Yeah, that was great, wasn't it? Anyway, how about this guy? It's Sonic. It is Sonic. What's he from? Uh, Sonic the Hedgehog. Yes, he is from Sonic the Hedgehog. And that will be all. What up, gamers? Here we have... I'm Benny. His name is Benny, and he's here to get his butt whooped in hard difficulty character guessing game. All right, how about this first one? Oh, I've seen it. It looks like an emoji, but... I don't know. Well, it is indeed very circular, but it is Magalore, who appears multiple times from the Kirby series of games, most notably as the main antagonist in Kirby's Return to Dreamland. Now, how about this one? Papyrus. It is Papyrus from Undertale. And how about this one? Shadow. No. Shadow is black. This one is white. Or, rather, this one is silver, as his name is Silver, from Sonic the Hedgehog. Now let's head on over the weather. Today's high is going to be 71 and tonight's low is going to be 50. Now for a quick blast of the past, let's wrap it up with this day in history. Stay classy, VC. October 18th, 1931. Mary had a little lamb, its streets were quite as slow, and everywhere that Mary went, the lamb was sure to go. Inventor Thomas Edison dies in West Orange, New Jersey at age 84. Among his many inventions, the electric light bulb, the phonograph, and the motion picture camera. 1962. Three scientists are named winners of the Nobel Prize for Medicine for their work in determining the double helix structure of DNA. Dr. James Watson of the United States and Drs. Francis Crick and Maurice Wilkins of Britain share the Nobel honor. 2001. 
CBS News announces an employee in Anchor Dan Rather's office in New York has tested positive for anthrax. It's part of the anthrax scare that kills five other people and shakes Americans following the September 11th attacks. Also in New York that same year, four disciples of al-Qaeda leader Osama bin Laden are sentenced to life without parole for their roles in the deadly 1998 bombings of two U.S. embassies in East Africa. 1968. Two American athletes are suspended for a high-profile protest at the Mexico City Olympics. Sprinters Tommy Smith and John Carlos give black power salutes during a medal ceremony. The athletes are later banned from all Olympic competition for life. And 1926. Rock and roll performer Chuck Berry is born in St. Louis, Missouri. Today in history, October 18th, Tim McGuire, the Associated Press.